Hey guys, welcome back. So today I am gonna be doing a video on a bunch of random non-beauty favorites. I haven't done one of these in a while and I have a bunch of things that I wanna share with you guys, just like everyday life items that I've been loving. I can already think of one that I left in the other room and now I'm mad, but we will retrieve it. We will retrieve it. And yeah, so I have just like kind of just random stuff. Lots of random goodies, a few wearable items, but no makeup or anything like that in this video. So if you're interested in hearing me ramble on about some things that I love, then just keep watching. So I'm gonna start with a food item because I'm actually really hungry. I'm not gonna eat one on camera, but I'm definitely going in once this video is over. So this is basically like a healthier version of Girl Scout Thin Mints. And if you don't like Thin Mints, I don't know what to tell you, but I love Thin Mints. Did, did they make you thin? No, but they make you feel good inside. So these I randomly found at the grocery store. One of my friends told me that this is actually on Thrive Market. I'm not on there, but um, if you can't find it in a store near you, maybe try there. But these are the Back to Nature Plant-Based Snacks Fudge Mint Cookies. So basically, I believe this brand just kind of like recreate some of like your favorite snacks, but with like better ingredients. And I'm obsessed with these. And little pro tip life hack these in the freezer in the summertime i don't know what it is it just feels like a really refreshing little minty treat love it they're so freaking good so that's one thing then next up we have a juice and this is a lemonade it's the simply light lemonade with raspberry it only has 25 calories i believe this is made with like stevia yeah so it has less calories than the traditional i think this comes in like a full calorie version as well but i wanted to mention this because this on its own it's great it's very fresh it's fruity it's it's very nice it's summery but it also is like the greatest mixer of all time you want it with vodka yes tequila yes gin yes you could even make like a sangria with this, with some SML wine, you know? Uh, it's it's just unbelievable. It goes so well with all drinks. You need to try it. Um, I think available at pretty much every grocery store. I like this better than like the powdered mix because this actually has like, you know, like the lemon pulp in there. So it feels like it's more like legit and genuine. So try this. I need to do like um, Instagram reels with um, some of my favorite drink recipes with this because it's so, so delicious. Now we're gonna move in a very different direction and we're gonna talk about vitamins. So these are from the brand Ritual, which I'm sure you guys have heard and seen a lot of other influencers talk and rave about this brand. I wanted to try them out for a while before committing to a sponsorship. And I have to say, I do really love them. So Ritual is sponsoring today's video, but they're good you guys so i take the essential for women multivitamin 18 and up so i really like these the nice thing about this brand is that they are sourced directly from the suppliers and i really like these i don't know if you can really tell on camera but they're these like little capsules and they go down really easily and they have like this like minty like aftertaste which i love because a lot of vitamins out there like have like a weird taste and you're like burping it up all day and it's like not nah, that's not the vibe so i really like these um they are 100 percent vegan friendly if that is important to you they're gluten-free non-gmo um they are allergy free as well so i definitely would recommend these to you guys i will have them linked in the description box below but if you're looking for something to add into your supplement regimen this is great kind of helps fill in any nutritional gaps and i definitely notice a difference when i am taking these so love them and if you want to get 20 percent off your first month go to ritual.com smlx020 and use code smlx020 so then another product i wanted to mention and i've talked about these on instagram quite a bit they are the highline wellness cbd melatonin gummies if you are having trouble sleeping at night, I would highly recommend trying these out. I've been using these for the past like three or four months and I have literally never slept better. Um, they have CBD obviously as well as melatonin. So it's kind of like the perfect combination, especially if you have like anxiety. Um, I always get like anxiety like at nighttime. I just start thinking about all the things. So I take these like an hour before I go to bed and I am out, I sleep well, I have 
very pleasant dreams. Some melatonins made me very violent in my sleep, so these do not, and I really love them. So I had to mention those, and they are gummies. They have oils as well, but this is like a little midnight snack or like a 10 p.m. snack, I should say, and they taste like blueberry, so I really like these. I believe that's it for all of the ingestible items. Now let's move on to some wearable goods. So I have a few pairs of shoes and like a few pieces of clothing. So let's talk about some sandals. Um, so I believe last year I did a video like this and I talked about my Grandals, the black Steve Maddens with the gold buckle. Um, mine are um, in the garage right now. So if you're interested, I will link them as well. But this year I got a pair from Target. These are the Target New Day. They have like this quilted pattern. They're Velcro on the top. So that's like the only thing that's different about these than the Steve Maddens. My Steve Maddens, like they strap on in the back, if you know what I mean. And so yeah, I love these. I wear them with like everything. Shorts, leggings, jeans. I just feel like they're so cute. I know these are very controversial and people like don't like them because they remind them of their grandparents. But I mean, we need to respect the elderly and get on board. <laughs> um, but I seriously love them. They're so comfortable and they're freaking adorable. So Highly would recommend those. Then we have another kind of geriatric vibe, but these are actually from the children's section. So we're just stealing from all age groups. These are New Balances and they are very similar to the pair that like Hailey Bieber and all the celebrities wear that they're always sold out, but they're also very expensive. I think they're like $180 or something. Um, so I found these and they are from the kids section. And I actually ordered these on Amazon. If they're not in stock there, I'll try to find them linked somewhere else. But they're almost identical. They're extremely, extremely comfortable. The only real difference is that the N is like a little bit skinnier than the other one. But I mean... Is that really that serious? I don't feel like it's that serious. So I would highly recommend these and yeah, they're very comfortable. I understand why people love these items. They're so comfortable. And now that I'm 32, it's all about the comfort, folks. It is all about the comfort. So love these. And I also wanna link uh, my favorite socks to wear with these. I, I can't show you them because all mine are so dingy and dirty looking that I'm actually embarrassed. I'm actually embarrassed, so I will link those socks. I'll put a photo, but they're the best. They don't slide down. Your feet don't sweat in them. You need them. And then my last and final sandal. These exact ones, I think, are sold out. I got them last season, but I've been wearing them nonstop. They are from Steve Madden. They are these wedges. They have kind of like a knit fabric at the top. They're so comfortable. I'm not touching the bottoms because they're very gross, and I don't know where they have been. Well, I do know, but I just really... I don't really know. I don't want to know. Um, I should have sanitized them. I should have sanitized them. But anyways, they, they add a slight little wedge heel. They're so comfortable. They go with pretty much everything and I'm obsessed. These are all very 90s vibes, but I'm a true 90s baby, born in 1990. It doesn't get more 1990s than that. So I really appreciate all these things coming back in style. So I had to grab a few of my clothing items. First, I wanna talk about these Levi shorts. Levi 501 shorts are my absolute favorite. They fit me better than any other jean shorts out there. So I have these in many colors. The colors that I've talked about in the past are all very light wash, but this year I decided to get a more traditional blue wash. Again, this is feeling very like 90 supermodel color to me and I love this color because I don't own any denim pieces this color. So it's a really like rich blue and this with, a white t-shirt is just so classic. I just am obsessed. And I would wear these with any of those shoes I just showed you. And yeah, they, I feel like these run maybe slightly bigger than my other Levi's. But the nice thing about Levi's is that even though there is no stretch, they break in. So I find that if I wash them and like kind of like shrink them in the dryer they're a little bit tight as first and then as i wear them they like break in and then we just repeat the process so i'm a huge levi's girl they will always do my favorite shorts they make your bum look good too 
Then next I want to talk about active dresses. So I've been wearing these on Instagram quite a bit. This is the Abercrombie one. It comes in a million different colors. I need to get more colors. This is the baby kind of like periwinkle blue. And so this is just like a basic dress, but it has shorts built in. And that's really nice if you want to like wear this like working out or like being active or you just want to be cute great option uh, this one has a pocket on one side so I definitely want to get more colors of this and for the Abercrombie I wear the extra small petite so they do offer different lengths which is nice and then the other one I wanted to mention is from the brand onesie and how cute is this pink gingham get up it is adorable so this one is uh, not as like active -y as the other one the built-in shorts are very like thin they're not see-through but they're not as like workout fabric so if you wanted to work out in one I would say go for the Abercrombie but this is so adorable and it's very lightweight it has that kind of you know yoga pant type fabric stretchy and I just love throwing these on and running out the door. You can dress it up, dress it down, really cute. And then I wanted to mention a pair of off-white denim. So I don't really love stark white denim a lot of the time. It just comes off like too blinding white. So I got these recently. They're from a Goldie. A Goldie does my favorite jeans ever, the a Goldie Lana. It, those are like my most worn ever. So these are the pinch waist, which I need to get in um, different watches as well because it's such a good uh, fit. So these are a, I will insert a photo, but they are a kind of like straight wider leg. So, so nice of a fabric. It's not stiff, it's very soft. These do not have stretch either. They're very similar to Levi's. You kind of have to like break them in, but then once you have them like broken in, they fit so nicely and they are really comfortable. They have a button fly, which I kind of prefer. I feel like that like sucks you in better when it's a button fly versus a zipper. And I just love the color. They're just this really pretty like bone color, not too creamy or like yellowy, but not stark white. And I just love these. Worth the splurge in my opinion. If you find a good denim that you like, for me, it's a goldie. You will wear them and you will get your money's worth. That's just my two cents. Then next we have this adorable straw visor that I got on Amazon. This is definitely giving like Golden Girls vibes as well, but it's okay. Uh, I love this for when I'm just like hanging out around the house. I usually have my hair like up in like a bun or a ponytail, but I'm not going to mess up my hair. But it's so freaking adorable. I love it. I love it so much. It's like wearing a hat, obviously. Like everyone knows what a visor is. Like why are you trying to describe what a visor is? I don't know. Anyways, I really like this visor. It is so adorable. It would be perfect for the beach or vacation. I just have to usually wear it in my backyard because I don't really go places that often. <laughs> so love that. I can get it on Amazon. Now let's move on to a few household items. First, I talked about this on Instagram the other day when I was on sale. I don't know if it's still on sale, but maybe keep an eye out, but it's totally worth it. It is from Dyson. So it's not the Airwrap. <laughs> this is the V8 Animal Vacuum. This is how much hair we have just in a like a one day period, not one day, but we have a lot of dog care. So this is the attachment that does the couch or like any furniture you have. It comes with so many attachments. It comes with the long one that you do for the floors, obviously. I'm obsessed with this. If you have a dog, cat, husband, child, anyone living in your house, you need this. It is amazing and I can't believe that I never got one of these. I, I'm out here raving about the freaking Dyson Airwrap when I should have been getting this. The Dyson makes my hair look amazing, clearly, but my house could have benefited from this a long time ago. So highly would recommend. Um, it's cordless, it weighs like five pounds, not super heavy. I love it, it has like a little charging dock that you can mount on the wall as well. I just cannot say enough about this. I'm obsessed. And when I posted about this, so many of you guys were like, oh my God, you didn't have one? 
you did not have one because everyone loves these and now I get it. I get it. Next, I wanted to mention my humidifier. I don't know if I've talked to you guys about this at all. I feel like I have, but I can't remember. But right now it's coming in clutch. I love this, especially for winter time when it's, you know, very dry and the air is really dry and you just can't breathe. Uh, but I'm also really loving it right now during allergy season because if you have allergies right now, I don't even need to go into details. You know what I'm saying. It's bad. It is freaking bad. Like allergies and pollen are on steroids this year. So anyways, uh, this is a humidifier. Oh, it has some dust on there. But it also filters the air at the same time. So it's kind of kind of like keep your nasal passages nice and hydrated, I don't know. And also like get out some of the allergens in the process. So I'm a big fan of this. I believe they carry it at Sephora now, which is great. And I have the one that's like, oh gosh, good thing this is empty. I have the one that is this like blush color, but it comes in other colors. And it has a filter that you change like every like six weeks. And definitely would recommend that. And then the last item that I wanted to mention to you guys is this handy, oh, it sounded like it was playing a song. Okay. Easily amused over here, clearly. Anyways, this is my handy dandy little laptop stand. Again, I can't believe I waited this long in life to invest in one of these because I've been sitting and hunching over a laptop for like, 10 plus years doing this job and usually I just have terrible posture or if I'm trying to get crazy I would just put my laptop on some sort of box and like MacGyver it but I was like you know what I'm gonna get one of those cool stands that all the like really sophisticated have their life together type of people uh, they have these and now I'm one of those people not really but I feel like I am love it your laptop just goes here and you can maneuver a bunch of different directions. You can fold it down if you want. And I just really like it. This is like the rose gold, like champagne color if you're into that, but it comes in like silver and black as well. So that's gonna wrap up this random lifestyle favorites video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any random things that you're loving, let us know in the comments so we can buy them as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. And I will see you guys next time. make the thumbnail who's gonna make it will it be the lemonade will it be the wannabe thin mints will it be the dyson what's gonna make the squad today